In this lesson, you will learn about the following. Matter States of matter Solid, liquid and gas Change in the state of matter Solution Solids dissolve in liquids Liquids dissolve in liquids and Gases dissolve in liquids Objects differ from one another in shape size, color and texture. The amount of space occupied by an object is called its volume. Everything around us is made up of matter. You and your friends are made up of matter. Your toys, games, food all are made up of matter. Matter is made of tiny particles called atoms. In some matter like gold, platinum and carbon, these atoms are able to exist alone. This means they need not combine with any other atom to exist alone. But there are some other atoms which are very active and do not stay alone. Such atoms combine with other atoms of the same or different kinds to form a molecule. Hydrogen, oxygen and chlorine gases are made of molecules. The molecule of each of these gases is made of two atoms of the respective gas. Water is made up of two atoms of hydrogen and one atom of oxygen. This is an example of combining of different types of atoms to form a molecule. Matter exists in different forms. There are three states of matter. These are solid, liquid and gas. In a solid state, matter has a definite shape and it occupies a definite amount of space. In this state, the molecules of matter lie very close to each other. A spoon, a book, the blackboard, etc. are some solids. In a liquid state, the matter does not have a definite shape but it occupies a definite amount of space. In this state, the molecules do not lie very close to each other. They have more space between them as compared to the molecules of solids. These molecules are able to slide past each other. Water, milk, soft drinks, fruit juices, etc. are some examples of liquids. In a gaseous state, the matter neither has a definite shape nor does it occupy a definite amount of space. Gases take the shape of their containers. They do not have a definite shape. Let us now learn about the change in states of matter. Water is normally a liquid but you get solid ice on cooling water in a freezer. At 0 degree Celsius, the liquid water changes into solid ice. This process is called freezing. On the reverse, ice can be changed into water on heating. This process is called melting. When water is boiled till 100 degrees Celsius, it changes into water vapor. This process is called evaporation. When water vapor changes back to water on cooling, it is called condensation. Let us now learn about the different types of solutions. When a solid dissolves in a liquid to form a solution, the solution is called a solid in liquid solution. Not all solids dissolve in water. Such solids are called insoluble solids. The milk is completely soluble in water. Here, both water and milk are liquids. Hence, their solution is called a liquid in liquid solution. Liquids that mix well in water are called miscible liquids. 
Oil does not mix well in water. It forms a distinct layer on top of water surface. Liquids like oil which do not dissolve in water are called immiscible liquids. The bubbles coming out of the soda are of a gas called carbon dioxide. This shows that soda is a liquid with a gas dissolved in it. Hence, it is an example of a gas in liquid solution.